And hey, Jim, remember all those videos we were looking at this morning of that flooding that was going through State College, Pennsylvania on Monday. All that flush flooding in the streets due to those storms. Walk, to Take a look at these images. You can listen to people discussing whether or not they can even walk through that rain, much less drive through it. Multiple areas. We, I think we even had to beep some of the tapes here. Multiple areas uh, were shut down due to this road flooding. This is video of cars driving through about a half foot of water right there. Can we walk so back? how do we find out what was going on in that area? Well, we go to Penn State student uh, and campus and res president actually of the campus weather service, uh, Ryan Breton. Hey, Ryan, good morning. Glad you're with us. Thank you for coming back to talk a little bit about this. What a wild day you guys had. Yeah, that's right, Sam. Thanks very much. Uh, it just kind of came out of nowhere last evening. We were expecting thunderstorms, but uh, we got a pretty good one here in State College with a lot of rain and hail. Now, when you and I were talking, when you guys get punched with a particularly bad storm, it kind of comes from one direction. Explain that to folks. Right. Uh, at least in the time that I've been here, it seems like the best storms that we get or the worst storms that we get typically come from the southwest. And this one uh, formed up over the Laurel Highlands, came from the southwest, went through Altoona, and then moved into State College from the southwest, went up and over the mountains, uh, and it didn't really die out once it got here. In fact, if anything, it was strengthening as it came through here. Now, you guys recorded almost two inches of rain at your weather station, but you picked up about half an inch in eight minutes, and I think that's the reason you had so much flash flooding. There's just no place for that water to go. Uh, kind of zooey yesterday. Has it straightened out a little bit? Is the flood water gone and everyone's back to normal? Yes, absolutely. It was a very quick flash flood. Uh, you know, we like we like you mentioned, we got a half inch of rain in just a, a matter of minutes, and that all piled up. Uh, and actually, our campus is up on a hill. Yeah. And the problem really is that all that water flowed down the hill and into right. downtown. And that's exactly right. where you see all the cars hanging out. All right, Ryan. Hey, thank you because we know uh, you know we love talking to you guys uh, up there at Penn State. So thanks for being uh, the geniuses you are. A junior this year. We're proud to have you on the show. We'll be right back.